So we install custom ROM to increase the performance of our phone. <laughs> but what if we want to increase its performance and battery life even further? Well, we install a custom kernel. So first of all, what is custom kernel? Kernel interacts with your phone's hardware and that's how you get this performance but many developers create their custom kernel to take the phone to its maximum potential. In this video, I will show you how to install and uninstall a custom kernel. So let's get started. So make sure you watch this video till end because I'm going to show you how to uninstall custom kernel and restore the stock kernel back to your phone. So currently I'm running custom room called Havoc OS 3.6. I just made a full review on that. If you want to check that out, the link will be in i button. So it's amazing room except the battery life. So to increase that, I'm going to install a custom kernel called Fox kernel. And now you can install any kernel you want. You can install Franco kernel. You can install Elemental X kernel. But for this video, I'm going to use Fox kernel. And you can use this video to install any kernel in any phone. If you want to find kernels for your phone, I will drop a link in description. So first of all, you need to download the kernel you want to install. So I will quickly download the Fox kernel. It will be in zip file. Now transfer and put this file in your phone's internal storage. Of course, custom recovery is required. I'm using Orange Fox Recovery. You can use TWRP or any other custom recovery you want. Doesn't matter which recovery you use, the process to install a custom kernel will be the same. And now we are going to boot into our recovery. So once we are in recovery, we are first going to back up our stock kernel. In case anything goes wrong or you just don't like the kernel, then you can back up the stock kernel and restore it. So for that, go to backup menu and then only select this boot option. If you want, you can name it whatever you want. I will simply name it kernel. And then swipe right to backup. Once that's done, go to install tab, locate the kernel you want to install and again swipe right to install. Now reboot your phone. So as you can see, I have successfully installed Fox kernel on my Redmi Note 4, which had Havoc OS 3.6 installed. You can use this process to install any kernel in any phone. Now let me quickly show you how to restore your kernel. So go back to your recovery again, then go to backup menu and find the backup you made for this kernel. As you can see, my backup is right here. Just tap on that and right swipe to restore your stock kernel. Now, I won't be doing that because I like that kernel and I want to use that on my phone. So that is how you install and uninstall a custom kernel in your phone. If you appreciate my work, please like this video. It really helps this channel. And if you understand Hindi and want to check out my Indian channel, I will drop a link for that in description box below.